You know what I'm saying? Ever since you broke up with the nigga with the fake eyes, you've been living your best life. What's good, YouTube? Khalil here. I just got a message saying that, um, you know, um, I don't know if y'all familiar with him, but a YouTuber named Illuminati was uh, talking to talking about me in my in his video um, about my ex. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to peep it, you know what I mean, see what everybody's talking about. So yeah, I'm about to watch it, see what's up. Just want to say, hope everybody's having a blessed day today. And um, and yeah, let's watch, uh, let's watch this. Listen, spiritual soul in the building, Dewey soul in the building. My nigga, I'm in the building, man. Simple. You know what I'm saying? What's good with your chunk? Boats. Hey man, check this out, bro. First thing first. This video is gonna be a little bit different, and this video is serious too. By the first of all, the goggles. Fuck with it. Them shits hard. <clears throat> Them shits is hard. My phone ringing. My bad, y'all. All right, back to the video. Wait. Corey Raven, my, my baby. Let me say this real quick. Corey, you one of a kind. You you are literally like one of the most They not goggles, they sleep I think they sleep masks, but anyway, yeah. Most beautiful. Still lit. You you are so fucking beautiful to me. Like I dead ass love this girl, bro. Like I love her. And then you post a pic yesterday, you getting thick, my baby. You getting thick, your shit is actually <laughs> like these, like you're getting thick. You was already my dream girl. Now you're getting thick. Now remember, I messaged you like a month ago and I'm like, bro, your grown woman weight is starting to kick in. I see you happy as shit. You living your best life. Me too. This ain't even no YouTube shit. Now, I'm not even coming here talking about a collab. No, no, no. Put that bullshit to the side. Bro, I want to fuck with you for real, for real. Like, I'm not even talking about no cuffing shit. I just want to be around you. You living your best life, you know what I'm saying? Ever since you broke up with the nigga with the fake eyes, you been living your best life. Why I gotta be the nigga with the fake eyes? You could just say X. That hurt, dog. That hurt. <laughs> but yeah, back to the video. Now I got a cut on my lip. You know what I'm saying? That's it. That's it, tough. I got a cut. That shit the worst, bro. Like, I just had chap licks, dog, and it start, it start straight in the fucking middle, dog. Every time you talk or eat something with season on it, man, that should be hurting, dog. Literally in my video where I was eating like uh Michelada and the f uh Dorito top, Dorito burrito, I was eating that sh and I was feeling that sh too, dog. I ran out of chapstick. My lip felt like some girl dry ass <laughs> ran up on it. <laughs> my lips somehow, I don't know how. That's tough, cause I'm fucking beautiful. My skin is beautiful. I'm getting cuts on my lip now. I'm gonna just give me some sun. Now check this out, y'all. At this point in my life, I really don't even want to fuck with a girl if she don't meditate. You can't even come in my door talking about bullshit because I'm not going to care. I may act like it, but it's nothing. I don't feel nothing inside for, for what you just told me. You can't come in my... I'm not taking care of no bitch. Facts. And all women are beautiful ass bitches, bro. Y'all are fucking beautiful. Like, I, I, I got to stop calling y'all bitches, but y'all are beautiful. I'm not taking care of no woman ever again. No girl is moving with me. I need my own space. I gotta. And for you females out there, us dudes is not babysitters. We not about to pay for you, feed you all the time. You are a grown woman. Grown woman. It's supposed to be mutual. You take care of me, I take care of you. We we benefit off each other. It's not just you leeching off me. That's not how it's supposed to be. I pay close attention to the girls that I find attractive now. Who do she hang with? If you see a girl, if she hanging with strippers, Bro, she has the, she could, if a girl can relate to thotties or strippers or killers or whatever, bro, she's one of those. Facts. You are who you hang with. Facts. You are what you attract. You're not coming in here thinking you about to get some of this clout in this dick and, bro, you're not bringing that parasite ass energy in my, you're not leeching off of me. You're a parasite. Freeloaders are parasites. Facts. They living off your energy. Corey, I have no friends, my baby. I don't talk to no one but myself. I have all the time and energy in the world for you. You can have all of my positive energy. 
You know what I'm saying? I'm on no fat. I've been on no fat for about 47 days. I ain't had no pussy in 47 days, my baby. My skin is glossing. I'm waiting for the sun right now. Look where I'm at. I'm looking at the window. I'm waiting for the sun. Sasha taking a nap. It's all good. Corey, I want you to know I'm not the same. Like, my baby, I'm not the same Solomonati. Me and you are meant to be. I'm not making this shit up. You getting sexier and sexier and you single. You living your bet. You are for me. Your friends is not ratchet as shit. You don't hang with thotties. You ain't always in the club. You taking nice pictures. You know what I'm saying? I want you. I want you. Facts. She do take nice pictures. Her friends are chill. And she party here and there. But she don't be all up trying to club every night and stuff. She rather be grinding yourself. So he's speaking facts, man. That's a that's a wifey type right there, to be honest. That's wifey type. <laughs> When you mention Solomonati, everybody think about all the negative shit, but nobody watching the spiritual videos, huh? I care about my spiritual videos more than bangers. I had a spiritual awakening. I am just want to live my best life now. I just got a new fucking car. You know what I'm saying? I just got a new whip. All type of shit. Corey? Y'all see, I'm coming on here. I'm not even talking about Clyde Sasha right here. Wait, no, look at her. Motherfucker waiting for me by, by the door. But listen. <laughs> I'm not even talking about collabs, Corey. I'm not talking about collabing with you. I know you don't give a fuck about YouTube. I relate to you in every way. I don't care about- She really don't. She don't care about YouTube, the drama, all that stuff. She just to herself and her business. If we, if we talk, we, we ain't got to talk about our conversations, nothing. You know what I'm saying? I love you. I really do love you, though, Corey. I really love you, bro. I've been chasing you for three years. I never chased a bit longer than a week. <laughs> I've been chasing you for three years. I'm not necessarily chasing you now. I'm just sending this energy to you because you're going to catch this energy and you're going to know. You're going to feel it in your heart. So, I'm, I'm going to scroll through this a little bit. You know I'm not bullshitting. I see the whip. I see. Hey, real quick, bro. I have said something. Gucci so in the building. You get a thick as fuck. You know you was already my dream girl, baby. I gotta get the fuck off before I pull out the strap on y'all niggas. <laughs> Dude, cursing out bugs and stuff. Uh, a lot of y'all tagged me in this video. I just peeped through it. It was it was really nothing bad said about me. Um, but the fake eyes thing, that was that was really it. That's nothing to get all hyped. That's nothing to get mad about or nothing. I have no problem with the dude. I, all positive vibes. He killing it right now on YouTube. I'm just minding my business. I'm eating my food up in here. I'm chilling, man. I'm chilling. I'm, I'm enjoying life. I'm, I'm good, man. Shout out to everybody who's showing me love and, and, um, being, and being positive and everything like that. I'm not really into YouTube drama. And I don't even think this was... This not even considered YouTube drama. And this wasn't even about me. This was more about him uh, pursuing Corey. So please don't tag me and stuff like this. It really wasn't that big of a deal. Some of y'all live for drama. Like, I really got some DMs making this into, like, some big thing. Like, oh, he's talking, talking head, this, that, about you, blah, blah, blah. Dude only said, now that you broke up with homie, I'm pursuing you. Like, that really wasn't that big of a deal or something to get mad at, period. That would be childish if I got mad over that. That's, like, little kid stuff right there. That would be, like, a little kid getting mad that a dude said his hat ugly. And then another friend coming over like, he said, yo, hat ugly. Fuck him up. Go blah, 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 blah. Nah, that's wag, dude. But anyways, yo, good luck to you in, in pursuing uh, whatever girl you want to pursue, man. I'm chilling. Shout out to all the people that's about to have their summer. Hope y'all having a blessed day. Hope y'all having a good time. It's grind time this summer. I want to see all y'all partying and stuff. I want to see y'all working towards something. Working towards a goal. Working towards y'all dreams and all that stuff. So, I'm going to catch y'all. This was really no no drama. This was nothing big. You know what I mean? I have no problem with homie. He cool. He seemed dope. He doing his thing right now. So, there's no hate. Subscribe to the channel. If y'all like food challenges and vlogs and stuff like that, go ahead and press that subscribe button. Like the video. And yeah, man, I'll catch y'all next time. Peace. Again, y'all, this video had nothing to do with hate, man. Uh, it's all positive vibes over here. I'm bored as heck. I don't know what to do with my life right now. I'm bored as heck. I'm about to order some food. I'm hungry as hell. <laughs> I'm hungry, man. I'm hungry, dog. What the heck, man? What should I eat, dog? Let me tell y'all something real quick for those who uh, get mad at, at people trying to highlight their exes. If you and your ex break up, you cannot mad, get mad that another dude is pursuing your ex kind of logic is that dog i know some people out there trying to fight dudes for trying to
Holla at they ex. Seriously? Seriously? Grown, move on, dog. What you doing? Like, there's literally dudes who break up with their girl, and they get bad, she moved on. Like, that's what we doing now? <laughs>